my most embarrassing kitchen story, there's a, there's a handful of them for sure. You know, we've all cut ourselves and done some stupid things on the first day on the job, but um, I think maybe my first, my most embarrassing culinary experience uh, would probably be my first uh, bad write-up. So, um, you know, food critics tend to, tend to like to exasperate those unpleasant experiences. So first one of those I got, probably my most embarrassing. Probably that in high school I did a good bit of uh, like drama, good bit of acting and things of that nature. Um, doesn't really come through. I'm not I'm not the most poised when it comes to on camera and situations like this, but I did do a good bit of acting and and um, some singing in high school. So if I wasn't a chef, I'd be involved in music somehow. I'd be producing or managing talent, something to do with the music industry for sure. Well, if I had to choose a last meal, uh, my mother being Cuban, she obviously cooks Cuban food like a, like a champ, and um, Ropa Vieja is probably my favorite thing that she makes. It's a, it's a stewed flank steak um, with a ton of veggies, cooks all day, and is served over white, just plain white rice. It's, it's definitely one of my favorite things to eat, and I would love to have that as my last meal for sure.